critical regions, bro. Hypothesis testing, easy peasy, squeeze the lemon. Right, how to do all of these, I just advise you do a diagram, especially with critical region questions. We just do a, draw a diagram of a binomial distribution. We have, we're testing the probability being 0 0.3. Someone has claimed that the probability is actually less than 0 0.3. So if this is our distribution, which outcome would have the highest probability most likely? Well, the average, you do NP, yeah? 50 times 0 0.3 is 15. So remember, this is a probability, and these are your X values. It's a bar chart, so the highest probability would have the outcome of 15. Now, the bars would be separate, but it's just a sketch. So I just keep them together, yeah? Now, what we're saying is, over here, how few outcomes would you need in order to conclude that this probability is too high. It should be less. So we draw the boundary. The question actually had a critical region of 10%. So this region here has to be 10% or less. Yeah, 10% or less. So remember what we said, we said, how few outcomes would you need in order to conclude that this probability is too large, it's probably lower. And we do all of this in the calculator. So basically, we're just gonna uh, get the, I'll show you guys again, a little POV and that. So here's your calculator. You're gonna go shift, you're gonna go seven, you're gonna go to binomial CDS, a cumulative distribution. You're gonna go variable. N was 50, P is 0 0.3. You're just gonna play around with values, like 10, for example. That's 8% or 7.8%. That's uh, Actually, no, we wanted 10% or less, didn't we? So maybe 11. Okay, that's too big. Yeah, so the answer is 10. Yeah, 0 0.078. So you're going to write down these values. So 10 was that value. So we're going to write it down. So x is less than or equal to 10 was about 0 0.078 dot dot dot. And then I'm going to show you that 11 was just too much. 11 gives you 0 0.139 dot dot dot, which is too much. So your critical region is x is less than or equal to 10. And that's how you do these questions in a much simpler way. Nice.